y'all doing red here just want to kind of do an update it's been a while since i've uploaded i know uh but basically um i went back to my old job back in may and i've been working overtime i've been putting in about 60 to 70 hours a week um just trying to acquire as much money as i can i've been trying to acquire more land out here at shotgun ridge um i haven't been able to do too much out here just because i basically i work full time more than full time and uh you know i feed my animals and i basically go um and watch my kids after that at their mom's house um it's not a lot of time for me to do a lot of extra stuff but uh, i am going to give you all an update about what new what's new out here um this right here was a uh a kennel that i built for cold water um you know y'all might remember my kind of my previous videos he liked to escape sometimes <laughs> um but uh the truth of the matter is uh you know usually i let him wander around at night whenever i was here he'd stay pretty close but uh one night i guess he went across the road to go play with the coyotes north of us and uh on the way back he he got hit by a car that was about a month ago now he is buried on the property now but um oh a couple weeks before he died um i quieted another dog um that's goose right there y'all may notice i, I kind of noticed my i i, I kind of named my dog silly names um you know this this new pup she's a, a pit bull she's a rescue um, I did not get her to replace cold water. I got her to be kind of cold water's girlfriend. Um, but she's she's really good. She's really sweet. She's she's a real good uh, head of farm security here. But yeah, her name's Goose. She stays close by. Um, I kind of move stuff around here all the time. Uh, I've got cold water's old dog house back in front of the fifth wheel again. Uh, here's the maneuver balkan or that that small tank project that I was working on uh, the problem was my Chicago electric welder my wire feed welder that I, I got from Harbor Freight it just wasn't real hot so uh, it wasn't really welding the, the quarter inch panels together as well as I, I hoped so here pretty soon I'm gonna hopefully have a uh, 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 generator welder that's going to be able to push out a lot more power a lot more heat i'll be able to uh, weld the panels together a lot better and i'll be able to continue back on that project i've still got the chickens both of them um, they're getting to be a little bit old now so i usually only get about uh, one maybe two eggs a day but typically it's about one egg a day um i've still got the pigs I don't have a freezer for them yet, but they are getting to be past that time. I've still got Frumpy, I've still got Goldie, I've still got Hershey. Y'all may, may have remembered that Hershey used to be the biggest, but he's not the biggest anymore. Now it's Goldie. But uh, they're just some good old pigs. I love them. Um, but uh, yeah, basically that's that's the update um, I've got a couple more batteries in my uh, my shed that I use for my power and that's basically just so I can uh, use my fridge there's all my batteries there I've still got my 3500 watt uh, pulser that I bought from O'Reilly's it's still working real good um, what I what I feed my pigs basically is a kind of a, a one part this red barn all stock feed it's like sweet feed and then two or three parts cracked corn but yeah the the pigs are doing real good um, yeah basically uh, I've been working real hard trying to pull as much overtime as possible. Um, I've got kind of my scrap area over here. It's a little neglected just because recently within the last few weeks I actually hurt myself at work. I cracked two ribs. So I haven't been able to do too much 
but uh, fortunately I was able to pay off my uh, my new acquisition it's a uh, 1.75 acres it's actually over there and uh, that's in partnership with uh, my quarter acre that's kind of over there and then my quarter acre that's here that's my home plot right here and uh, eventually the plan is to eventually acquire so many plots out here at the uh, golden acre subdivision that uh, I can kind of you know um, be a, a, a horse trader about it and try to trade with some of the other people that own land out here and try to get a larger more uh, continuous plot of land but uh, that's what's new out here I've still got my my CB base station and tower. I love it here at Shotgun Ridge, out here at the Micro Homestead. Y'all have a great, great day. If you enjoyed this content, please give it a like, subscribe, share with your friends. Thank you.